Mm, hello, and uh, yeah, yeah, I, I'm aware this is from Crisis. Yeah, I rendered it myself in the Crisis demo. So uh, I won't be talking about 3D, so you can leave your imagination. Uh, select this thing here, or well, some of you may have it. Otherwise, I I don't know, like here, just click this grid. It's the 3D view indicator. And let's say user preferences. Okay, go to the first thing, view and controls. Uh, you see a lot of uh, stuff in here. Well, I think the most important thing is uh, zoom. Continue, dolly, and scale. Uh, I have mine on dolly. Most of you have it. Uh, continue is if you want a continue zoom. Scale if you want it scaled. I think you fig figured that out already. Uh, edit methods. If you have a lot of RAM, you know, like 2 gigs, I suggest moving to 64 instead of 32 as set by default. Okay, so 64 if you make a lots of mistakes. Okay. Auto keyframe if you want, although I strongly suggest you don't want. Okay and uh, duplicates well most important thing uh, not the material no textures uh, no oh, I uh, I don't know maybe useful ah, never mind language and font this one's gonna be interesting so click on this soul button okay select font let's say crisis font don't ask me where I got it not even I know where I have it from. So uh, you'll see no crisis interface. But that's not very helpful. Themes. Uh, this can be helpful. Most of you have it like this. A uh, dull thing, but you know, it's Blender. Why should it be interesting? Well, it is interesting, but not in view. So they have another preset, rounded. Uh, you may have it like this, especially if you're on Linux and have your three little buttons in here. Mm, I love Linux actually, okay? So don't hate me. Uh, but I have the max view. It's done by me, you know, little modifications. Uh, let's get on with autosave feature. This one's interesting. If your PC, you know, crashes or something else, you'll have a failsafe file okay so uh, click on this autosave temp files recent files if you have uh, say 10 megabytes available I suggest uh, setting to 20 files okay I uh, made my shortcut in here you know this is the current project so um, I'll make it save uh, every minute and save versions I recommend uh, setting to zero because if you set it to one or so when you save your current project save as and uh, overwrite it you'll have untitled dot blend one so you won't uh, open it so quickly so I suggest I suggest zero okay system and open GL uh, this one's interesting and it needs preview okay so let's say I have this cube okay and uh, here I have solid open GL lights up to three lights so you can toy with this thing you know like this let's say colors red ish um, green ish and my favorite blue ish so you'll have an abomination eh, never mind that it's it's your it's your taste you know win codex uh, enable all codex if you want to save under your own codex although I strongly suggest the uh, built-in AVI audio mixing buffer that depends on your um, audio card so leave it to 1024 
I have it on 2048 because I uh, can. Keyboard, uh, emulate numpad for those of you that uh, use, you know, laptops. They don't have the numlock slash star minus plus enter. You know, the numbers on the right. So for those of you with uh, with the keyboard, uh, do not emulate this. Disable caps lock. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe you want it. System. I have no idea whatsoever what this is. So don't interfere. Mip maps for OpenGL. Uh, I suggest again leave it as it is. And file paths. Uh, this is interesting. Yafre export. Uh, I don't use Yafre, so I have no idea. Fonts. Where to have your fonts from? Uh, D Windows fonts. That's for me. I have installed uh, Windows on the D disk. Uh, renders. D Blender renders. Mine. So these are all my uh, my artworks. Okay. My masterpieces. Uh, textures. Where to take your textures from? I don't have a directory or anything. Pythons. Uh, your scripts. Again, I don't have one. Texture plugins and sequence plugins. Uh, no, don't have them. Sounds. Where to take your uh, sound library from? I don't have sounds, so can't help you. And temp. This is where um, fluid simulations and uh, you know temporary files will be stored. So I suggest making your own temp. Okay. Uh, not common with uh, Windows or Mac temp. You know whatever that is. Cancel anyway. And back to the most important part, whatsoever. Uh, you press Control and U click OK if you are sure you know what you're doing. Uh, clicking on the Control U action will permanently save your um, your view. If you want to tamper with the settings I suggest going to the um, the save you know whoops, uh, where you installed the uh, blender and go into dot blender directory and here you have dot b dot blend this is the default uh, file so I'm not gonna save this because it looks horrible but uh, you know what to do okay so see you next time uh, next time again and I can't brag enough 30 frames per second every detail on high because I can't have DirectX uh, 10 and at a resolution of 1440 by 900. No mentalizing though. Oh well, see ya.